Nigerian Army Authority has said that the superior firepower of the troops of the military joint task force led the notorious Mumbe Oluchi who led unknown gunmen to flee when the troops had contact with them last Friday in Imo State. According to the Nigerian Army Public Relations Unit, the gunmen are members of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOM and its armed affiliate, Eastern Security Network, ESN. The Army Authority in a video showed shallow graves and decomposed bodies of kidnapped victims at the B-44 camp said to be the hideout and a place where kidnapped victims are tortured by the Monday Oluchi Obu led gang. The Joint Task Force Operation Udoka in continuation of its operations to stamp out the criminalities of IPO, ESN from the South East Nigeria has raided and cleared the notorious Mumde Oluchi Ugu camp also known as B-44 camp in Imo State. The raid operations which commenced on Thursday the 28th of March 2024 was aimed at clearing non-indigenous people of Biafra, IPO, and its armed affiliate the Eastern Security Network, ESN, camp located at the border of Anjaba River bordering our Umama community in Oru East local government area and Asia community in Umatoni local government area of Igbo State. During the clearance operations that continued on Friday, troops came in contact with the criminals. Due to the superior firepower, the terrorists were forced to flee into the nearby bushes with various degrees of injuries and gunshot wounds. Troops further encountered and detonated some of the planted improvised explosive devices, IEDs, meant to hinder troops' movements. It is disheartening to discover that some innocent individuals, some reportedly kidnapped, were gruesomely murdered and buried in shallow graves in the camp without any form of dignity. As part of the Nigerian Army Civil Military Cooperation Relations, Forensic analysis of some of the exhumed corpses will be done for a befitting burial. Other items recovered include three IEDs, one RPG bomb, one motorcycle, seven mouth and handheld radios, local jewelries, a foreign ATM card, two SIM cards, two voters cards, plate numbers of stolen vehicles, and a toolbox. The Force Commander Joint Task Force Operation Budoka Major General H.T. Dada wished to assure all citizens of the end as commitment to ensure peace and stability in the region. The general public are enjoined to continue providing timely, reliable and credible information through its toll-free line 193 and press option 2 to speak directly to a representative, the Army Authority stated in court in a statement published across Nigerian Army social media handles. Osasuwa Kang Nebe, bring the news in a more digital way.